Cracking my good man, Missy. I'm, I'm, uh, I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. It seems like Wednesdays have just become my blur day. They've just become my, like, just, it's, I, I've nearly finished, I've nearly finished the week, you know, in terms of work, my work week, and I'm just blur. So... But in saying that, I'm feeling a lot better right now after work. I'm ready. I'm, I'm keen for tonight. I'm keen for keen for a stream tonight, and uh, I'm I'm keen to have you all here. Accurate. Hello, sir. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Good to have you here. How you doing? What's cooking? Good looking. Accurate. What's uh uh um these beats are vibes? Yeah. No. So apparently, I'm trying to remember. I think these are, I think this is a playlist on Spotify developed. Yeah, it's a, it's a, it's a League of Legends uh, playlist that they create, that the company of League of Legends, they created with a bunch of artists for copyright free streaming. It's pretty good. I'm loving it. And it's a good segue. It's a good musical segue into, uh, it's a good musical segue into the game that we're going to be playing this evening. Ah, this one. I miss it. You miss it. Then you should listen to it. <clears throat> okay. Right. Let's start with... Some clippies. Clippity clippities. Because why not? Oh, well, so much for this run. Go away. Milk's hey, great. Please, no, answer my question. I fucking love milk. I'll drink it like straight that's out of the like... jug, dude. And people are like, bro, that's gross. Milk is like cow titty milk. What the fuck? But I'm like so fucking what? You drink milk out of your mom's titty you? <laughs> Oh my god, Haley. Are you there? How old are you? I hate titty milk. I mean, the opposite. I love cow milk. I love milk. How did you die? Milk good, titty bad. I mean, not titty bad. Where are you from? How old are you? Oh! 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 <laughs> is Melbourne out of lockdown now too? Yeah, technically, uh, yes. Melbourne is now officially out of lockdown. Hell yeah. Oh no, this is it. Uh, you've been listening to Acrisis. I've been listening to my good friend Pikas. Pikas? Pikas. Pikas new tracks. He does lo fi and it's just lovely. Pikas. That's awesome. Oh my sometimes, god. Sometimes. Sometimes you just need just something lovely. And for me, that sometimes is a lot of the time. That happened in the first game. 
I, I listen to nice music a lot. <laughs> it's not like it'll kill us. It will. If a if a if a, a simple bucket of water <laughs> If a I simple mean, bucket uh... of water can kill me, then definitely a uh Yep, there it goes. You oh my god! <laughs> You're hey, the out of me. Holy shit, look at the blood. I'm fucking out. Moss. Hey, uh... okay. Alright, last, last clip. <sighs> Someone needs to clip <laughs> some of this. <laughs> this is amazing. Oh, he wasn't full of my face. He, he he went in the closet, but he didn't instantly like. Arr. Look at him. He's oh, he's adorable again. Really funny, haha. -ha. All right. Hello, everyone. How's it going? Good to see you. Uh, Akron says he's gone from twenty monthly to around four hundred. That is a lot. That's a lot of music. Uh, all the love and power to him. Uh, is that the phrase? I don't know the phrase. English words. Words. English. It's not like it's my first language or anything. Um, uh, yeah, Akrit is your mate on Spotify. Uh, indeed, he is. Most of his tracks are copyright free. You just gotta play the right ones. Most. Oh, they should make a. Should make a little cheeky little playlist of all the copyright free ones, and then I'll put do some music on this stream maybe pika sonic yeah no 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 go ahead uh, are you talking to missy or are you talking to me are you talking to missy or are you talking to me you talking to me you talking to me um oh both okay gotcha right well uh Hello, hello, Akrit. Hello, Missy. Uh, nice to have you beer. H have you beer? Have you beer? Not even a beer. I have a Coke. Um, nice to have you here. Um, we we're playing. I do a lot of celebrating Australian games, and usually that it usually that's me playing. Um, that's usually me uh, playing games like Hollow Knight and uh, like well-known Australian games. But today. Tonight, tonight is different. Tonight is different because we're playing a fairly new, fairly new Australian game that's come out of Tasmania uh, by a company called uh, la, 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 Myriad Game Studios, a uh, small little, uh, small indie dev team of about like I think it's like five people uh, made a game and. Just from the trailer, I can tell it's going to be great because it's got such good music and it's 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 actually like very apt for the conversation we're having right now about really nice, calming, lo-fi music. So, um, so yeah, let's 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 not waste any more time, shall we? Get ourselves into the game mode. Let's pause the music in Spotify <clears throat> and let's jump in to where the snow settles. Now this is a, uh, from reading the description of the game, it is a short narrative experience. Um, so this could be like a one-off, uh, this could just be a, like a one-off stream of playing this game. Which is good, sometimes, sometimes I like, like a game that just like, boom, boom. Like Paradigm went longer than I expected. And I love, and I really, really enjoyed Paradigm. But sometimes it's nice to have a game that's like you sit down and you play it one single session, boom, you're done. You're done. All right, cool. Here we go. But yes, no, the from from the trailer, the music was instantly just. I wanted, I wanted to play. It. Oh, hello, person. When you see this icon, press enter to interact with it. Is this winter going to last forever? I might actually, before I continue, uh, where's that chat? I'm just going to turn down the... There you go, just turn down the chat opacity a little bit. There we go. <clears throat> uh, enter. 
the sun seems so sad. Esther is out there hunting every day, and I can't even grow turnips. I hate this. Aurelia, can you come here for a moment? Uh, can I move? Can I move? Oh. Oh, there we go. Ah, this music is so good. Let me turn up the game music just a little bit. I miss our trips into the wilderness. Esther always knew what to do. But even the hunters can't stand this cold for more than a few hours. I wish I could help. The ground's still frozen solid. It just never changes. Hasn't anyone cleared this tree? Oh, hello. Aurelia, you have to be brave for me. I'm leaving tomorrow. But you'll freeze. Oop, oh, oh, it's dust governor. I have to. The village will starve if I don't. No one came back from the last hunt. What if you... It's my job to protect us. Why don't we head out to the Standing Stones for a bit? We could spend some time together. We haven't done that much lately. What if the Elders catch us? They've got bigger things to worry about. They won't even notice. It's not like we're going far anyway. Here we go. Chapter two, sisters. I might actually, I might hide chat for this one. Because it's a nice, such a nice cinematic experience that I don't want to, uh, I don't want to cover it up. Come on, Aurelia. Are we going to pray at the stone? Don't be silly. I'm just going to pay my respects. I'll pray to the spirits that you have a safe hunt. If I was going to pray, I'd ask for an end to this accursed winter. Maybe this time they'll answer. Who's a lovely? Ooh, there's a path this way. I wonder if I'll be backtracking at all. Don't want it too far away from me, okay? Alright, cool. All right, I'm not meant to go that way. Just yet. We used to come out here all the time. I miss those days. Mulberry picking, fishing in the river, exploring. <laughs> what about that time you ran off and got lost? Okay, maybe it wasn't all great. I wouldn't want to spend the night out here on my own either. I could hear creepy sounds all around me. It was terrifying. Hmm. It was never this cold. You wouldn't survive that now. Are you sure you have to go? Shh. I'll be fine. This is exactly what I wanted to play after the day that I've had today. It's just 
nice and calming, and it's lovely. Ah. Bad things are happening. Are you sure this is safe? The elder said only hunters could leave. What's the worst that could happen? Oh, Esther. Trust me. So, who else is going? Uh, well, just me and the other hunters. We're going to try and make contact with our sister village. They aren't too far from the Great Ravine. Oh, they might know what's going on. Let's pray they can help. Akron says, Wednesdays are just not good days. I also had a not so good work day. There you go. Then this is perfect for, for the day that we're both having. I know something is wrong. And I'm going to find out what. Esther, you, you can't fix the weather. We have to do something. Aurelia, I have to do this. No, I don't want you to leave. I know. Is there a thing thinking? Nope, no thing thing. Just follow Esther. Pull your coat tighter, okay? It's gonna get colder. But I'm already freezing. I can barely feel my toes. Don't be a baby. Trust me, it's a lot worse further out. You've come this far, just a little further. Moving through some of that dense snow. How do you do this all the time? Practice. The elders must really trust you. Of course they do. Why else would they ask me to go? Uh, Missy says we got some not so great news today too. Not awful, just not great. Oh, Missy. I'm sorry to hear that. Feels like, you know, we just got out of lockdown today and already it's not going great. <laughs> so I hope this helps. How are we going to get through? I guess it finally collapsed. It's always been a little unstable. Never like this, though. We'll have to go this way. Here, through the trees. Yeah, I might turn the game up just a little bit more. Wait, you want me to go across that? It's fine. Look, I'll go first. Nope. Nope. No, thank you. Esther, I can't. You can. Come on, Aurelia. You got this. Whoa. Whoa. Only time I'm doing that. Mm. Nearly walked off the edge. We're here. Wow. It's so pretty. I forgot how beautiful it is here. 
It's nice. Weird. It looks different. So what are we doing here? We're following tradition, laying an offering for our trip. What do you mean, our trip? Aren't we going home? We're gonna find out what's going on, Aurelia. You and me. Aren't you going out with the hunters? They wouldn't let me. The elders said I was too young. But we can do it. We can find the other village. Esther, I can't help. This is bigger than anything I can do. Come on, don't look at me like that. I'm sorry, alright? You've come this far. Why turn back now? I'm just a farmer, Esther. I can't possibly help. Esther doing a little cheeky, cheeky lure us out and getting us to do the whole quest adventure thing. Forcing us to go on a journey to learn self-confidence and all of the things, but I feel like something bad's about to happen. Getting that, getting that sense that things are not quite right. I mean, apart from the, apart from the perpetual winter. Ooh, floating stones. Ominous. Wait, this definitely doesn't look right. It looks sick. Oh no, the bad sick, not the good sick. I misread that. It's all, it always looks so bright. And now it's all gloomy? Yeah. Loomy. I wonder if it's still warm. What do you mean? Well, um, normally it's warm. You've touched the sacred stone? Esther! It's fine. Nobody was around to catch me. You would be in so much trouble if the elders found out. Who cares? All they do is sit around the village all day. Want to try? No! You're not supposed to! Do you always do everything the elders say? No, of course not. Go on then. I dare you. You're not a baby. You're my little sister. Come on. But what if... Just touch it. Oh. It is warm. Oh, nah. We fucked it. We broke it. Oh, no. Chapter 3. Into the Dark. Warm. What the? What just happened? Esther? What is this place? Esther, are you there? No, this can't be happening. Esther! Ooh, footprints. They glow. Esther! Please. Someone. Anyone. Ooh, cool little footprints. Help me. Got some creepy ass voices going on as well here. What's this? It came from the stone. Alright. I gotta fix stuff. Great ancestors. The stone. It's broken. Maybe 
this way? No, I'm going back the same way I came. I wonder if we're in some sort of alternate dimension? Or a mirror dimension? Or something like that? I wish Esther could see all this. She'd be ten steps ahead, inspecting all these strange plants. Oh, what is that? What is that? Is that a snail? Is it a snail? What, it's a slug? It can't be. A, a spirit? Esther is never going to believe this. I wonder what it's doing out here. Maybe, maybe I can talk to it. What, um, what if it's not a spirit? Come on, Aurelia, you can do this. Uh, hello? Are you okay? can I do? Too much. Too much? Uh, much better. Mm, thank you, human. I... I didn't... I, I mean, you, you're welcome. Are you a spirit? Indeed I am. My name is Luso. I owe you a great debt, young man. Oh, I'm just glad you're okay. My name's Aurelia. What was that stuff? The energy of Mother Earth. When concentrated and re unrefined, it becomes poisonous to all life. You did something with it though how did you wait is that a fragment of hollowed stone what how oh. did you damage one of the sacred stones what this rock oh, I found it on the ground you just found it a shard of unbreakable mother blessed stone I swear, I just found it. It was on the ground near a broken standing stone. I think... I think that's how I came here. I touched... I know I shouldn't have, but... I touched the stone. There was a flash of light and then I was here. Hmm. A likely story. Very well. You seem trustworthy enough. Truthfully, they had started becoming weaker long before you arrived. You see, Aurelia, we have a problem. Something is destroying the stones. Or I should say, someone. How could anyone? Yes, hard to believe, I know. But it's true. Listen. I can explain more, but I need to get going. Come with me if you wish, and I'll tell you more. Alright. Found a spirit. Spirits? Are uh, real? Sorry, give me one second. Should I follow Luso? What if they are dangerous and telling me lies? I just want to get out of here. Maybe they can help me get home. I like the pretty footsteps. I like the pretty footsteps. Also, I'm liking this uh, Spirit World color scheme going on. 
It all started with a human appearing here. In the realm of the spirits. A nice enough fellow. Oh, we got some more balancing. We've done this before. Sorry, we saw him standing right inside you. But he wasn't happy. Not happy at all. But we couldn't help. We've never left. How would we know? This is our home. Eventually, he disappeared. That's when things took a turn for the worse. Hey, you Australian moss, says Casey. Consume. Oh, I have to hydrate. Thank you, Casey. Thank you, Casey, for the hydrate. Also, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. This game is already so freaking gorgeous. It is. It is just delightful. I, I think that's the best way to describe it. It is Meow. just delightful. Meow. Also, did that pop up? I don't know if that popped up. Let me try that again. Meow. Yep, there it is. <laughs> so yeah, so for those of you who were here earlier, this game is called Where the Snow Settles. And it's a game made in uh, Tasmania by a indie dev team called Myriad Game Studio. Well, I think that's what they're called. Let me just double check that. Myriad Game Studio. Yep, I was correct. Oh, I have to hydrate. Thank you, Casey. Thank you, Accurate, for the hydrate. And it's made predominantly by, I think, a team of five. A team of five people made this. Clouds of wild energy started to appear. Great cracks forming in the earth. Rumors of spirits disappearing. And now, damage to our stones. I suspect it has to do with that human, Iris. Ah, Iris. Iris? Hey game, leave leave some aesthetic for the rest of us right now. What's this? It's connecting to that plant. Wow. It's beautiful. So many things around here glow. Like they're magical. Iris sounds close to Isis. Yes, it does. But it's I R R U S. Iris. Iris. Uh, like they're magical. Remember how you freed me earlier, Aurelia? The same energy that was holding me down is pulling around this plant. This is not natural. Perhaps you can try that again. It absorbed the energy. This little piece of stone sure likes to attract a lot of attention. I have to go through this forest? It looks so gloomy. Do you think there's wild animals or other things in here? I'm not afraid. I'm just a farmer. I don't have anything to defend myself with. Take courage, young one. It may look foreboding, but many of my kind call it home. 
You will be safe here. Just watch out for that human. I do not know what Iris would do if he finds another of his kind here. Be wary, Aurelia. But we must continue. Uh, okay. going. We're heading towards the next closest stone. I want to see if there are any signs of damage. What will you do if it's broken? That, my dear, is a very good question. As you saw earlier, even spirits aren't immune to raw spiritual energy. Usually this isn't a problem, as it's incredibly rare. But without the stones to regulate things, well, it will become far more common. Not to mention dangerous to all living creatures. <laughs> Kaisi says, it's always magic stones. It's always magic stones. That's where you come in. Huh? Me? Yes, you. Or I should say, that shard of yours. It's retained some of the properties of the stone it came from. Wait, uh, hold on, this little stone can help? Yes, I'm hoping it can help restore the connection to a fractured stone. The connection between our worlds. How? That energy has been misplaced, and you're returning it to its rightful resting place. Oh, right. Can I give it to you then? You'd be much better at that. No, no. Do not worry, Aurelia. You'll be fine. Besides, I cannot carry the shard. What if I mess it up, though? I could break another stone. What if... Aurelia, calm yourself. I will be here to guide you. Okay. Thanks, Luso. I just... This is all so strange. <laughs> this is also strange. Yep. Walks away. Or, I should say, floats away. Break the fucking... Kaisi! This is meant to be a feel-good game. Oh, there's another little thing. Hello? Hey, hey, human is here. Come to eat me up. Taste like rotten snarflax fruit, but human like bad taste, yes. What? No, I'm not gonna eat you. Why would I do that? G gross. <laughs> yes, gross, yes. Rotten, like the other human, yes, rotten fruit from the same tree as you. I have no idea what you mean. I don't know this other human, but my friend here says he's bad. Yes, very bad. Very rotten. Likes to eat too much. Too much indeed. Chased me out of my home. Rotten human. Oh, he chased you away? Do you want to come with us? We're trying to figure out what's happening with the stones. Come with you. A human. And my friend Luso. He's a spirit who had to leave home too. I promise I won't eat you. Trust in human, I think not. But I have nothing else to do. Yes, I'll travel with the maybe rotten human. I sense it's something familiar. Ah, yes, that will do nicely. A traveling home. Huh? Did he just disappear? Interesting. They must trust you. A curious individual. I think that spirit just went into my stone shard. More pretty lights, please. I would like some more pretty lights. I 
think that's another plant in the distance. La, 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 la. I think that's another plant in the distance. <laughs> Guys, he says I'm trying to break the stones. You evil person. This is, there's always one person. There's always one person. You provide, like, even in D&D, you provide this beautiful, serene environment, this great, lovely moment, and then there's one person that wants to <laughs> ruin the moment. It's all good. It happened again. The light flows through my shard. It's beautiful. Is this what you were talking about, Luso? Mm, you are correct, young one. Some plants attract misplaced energy, and it appears you can interact with it. Oh, we got another friend. Oh, wait, is that saying? No, a new friend. New friend. <laughs> Stay away from me, murderer. <laughs> Kaisi says, Moss, I want to help my chaotic neutral rogue self. Let's break the stones. No. As the paladin of this group, I am bound by oath to preserve the wholesomeness of this game. No. <laughs> Stay away from me, murderer. What? I'm not a murderer. I'm a friend. Please don't be afraid. A friend? Bah! With my own eyes, I've seen you kill kind, consuming spirits. We're not all the same. Please, I'm not like them. She speaks the truth. Huh? What are you doing travelling with a human? Aren't you afraid of what it'll do? Hey, my, I'm not a nit. My name is Aurelia. She is helping to discover the cause of all this discord. And she has a connection with a fragment of the stones. Ah, really? It still seems suspicious. I don't trust it. I said I'm not in. Trust me then. She is not like the other. <clears throat> Very well then. If I can't trust a fellow spirit, that really is the end of the world. I'll travel with you, if you both don't mind. I too wish to discover what is the cause of all of this. <laughs> Missy says I've created a D&D &D character. I'd love to play. I just need a table to play at it. Oh, Missy. It's a deep, dark hole when you start creating characters before you have a game to play. And, it's, <laughs> and, it's, and it's, it really makes you sad when you don't <laughs> when, when that happens. Kasi <laughs> says, yes, I consume spirits. My favorite is Apple Moscato. <coughs> Apple Moscato. I mean, these spirits... Each they they are coloured in such a way where they could, you know, they look like cocktails. But if you try anything human, I'm out of here quicker than I can say I knew it. Okie dokie. Ooh, pretty water. Pretty glowing water. Missy says, I'm also creating a world with no party to play in it. So big void of pain. Oh, Missy. Oh, that's so sad. Oh, can I go this way? No, I should probably follow the spirit. I should probably follow the spirit. Ooh, waterfall. I'm loving the music and the aesthetic of this game. Tell me about your world. What's it like? It's much like this. In fact, most of the landscape is exactly the same. The colours are very different, though. The colours? Yes, it's darker here, but with lots more lights, too. Like, everything has been highlighted in different ways. Sounds like your world is a bit boring. Does it all look the same? Oh, no, not at all. It's just... 
different. Everywhere you go, there's different things to see. New plants and animals, different sights and smells, new dangers around every corner. I guess that's why I didn't leave home very often. The village was safe, even if it was boring. Ah, how are you feeling about being here then? Everything must be new scary. It's all so unfamiliar. I'm worried that I'll be trapped here. What if I can't get home? What if I never see Esther again? Is she searching for me right now? Is it my fault? Getting trapped here? No, Aurelia. It's not your fault. Nor is it your sister's. Sometimes things happen outside of our control. The only thing that matters is how you react to change. It can be scary and unpredictable, but that's okay. Everyone has times where they're afraid and feel like they're being overwhelmed. Sometimes a bit of help is all you need. There's nothing wrong with asking for help. We all need it at some point in our lives. Even me, a solitary spirit who has lived for hundreds of years. I still seek out help from my fellow spirits. Thanks, Luso. Sometimes, I just feel like the world is against me. Like nothing I could do would ever be enough. I don't know if I can do anything to stop what's happening, but we can try. That's all right, Aurelia. That's all we can do. Australia is very good at making wholesome games. First, we had Necro Barista, and that had some lovely, lovely moments. And then we got this. Uh. Kaisi says, then a white one would taste like a pina colada. Oh, I could really go for a pina colada right now. Uh, it's on fire, a speciality California and a... What? It's on fire, a speciality... A speciality California and a continent. Con content? Content? What? What? <laughs> oh, hello, little one. Are you here to see the end? The end? The end of the world. N no? Surely things aren't that bad. Oh yes, they are. My dear, very much so. Your favourite is Frog Detective? Oh, Kaisi! Uh, oh, Kaisi, were you, were you here for the Frog Detective playthroughs we did? Or have you played that yourself? Everything is unravelling. I can feel Mother Earth getting weaker every day. Soon we'll all be dust and ashes. You've seen it too, haven't you? The destruction. I... I guess so. Oh no, please don't tell me things are going to keep getting worse. Such is life. Things can only get worse. You can see it if you look. The stones, visible extensions of our great mother, connect the land and the heavens. That is why you can see them broken, almost lifeless. Ah, you were there. Yeah, Frog Detective was going, oh, third one's coming out soon. Third one's coming out soon. I'm very excited about that. It's going to be good. The connections are sundered. The energy that flows through all living beings is being sucked into the resulting void. There is nothing we can do. We are simple caretakers of the great Mother Earth. Only those who can break the connection may be able to fix it. Did we do this? Humans, I mean. Perhaps. I would not be surprised. As timid as you seem, others of your kind are not so caring or brave. You... You think I'm brave? Indeed. You are here, are you not? I am here. 
Oh, oh no, Kaisi, what have you done? <laughs> what have you done? I forgot about, I forgot about Barry. All right, also posture check, thank you. Thank you, thank you. All right, this is gonna be interesting. I'm gonna do the same. No, Barry is gonna be doing the same voices, but Barry's got his own little filter. All right, cool, Barry, you're up, buddy. Oh, hello, everybody. Hello, Kaisi. Hello, Missy. Accurate if you're here. Hello to you, too. Uh, let's keep going. <coughs> I am here. Thanks. I didn't introduce myself. I'm Aurelia. Pleased to meet you, Aurelia. I'm Taylor. Did you want me to come with you to Taylor? Want to become famous? Oh, no! Absolutely not! Absolutely not! No! No, no, no one gets famous! No one gets famous! <laughs> uh, uh, do you want me to come with... Do you want to come with, to, with me too, Taylor? To see the end of the world? Or maybe to try to do something to stop it. Uh, yes, I'd like that. Perhaps I'll see more of that bravery before the end. No? <laughs> what? What are you talking about, Casey? Um... Aurelia, you've collected a lot of residual energy in that shard. I've never seen so much in one place. Let's go to the stone before it gets too unstable. Kaisi, what do you mean it's not me? What you talking about? What you talking about? This game looks absolutely delightful. Very, very pretty. <gasps> Yay! We got more. We got more glowy things. We got some mushrooms. Ah! I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. We are getting close now, Aurelia. Okaisi well, says you can't get famous just because you said no one can be famous. Kaisi, Kaisi. No one gets famous. No one. Everyone, everyone will be the same. Everyone will be equal. Oh god, whoa, 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 whoa. I sound like a I sound like a, a computer AI that's wanting to dictate the the, the rest of the world. Sorry everyone. I didn't mean for that to get over to come over me like that. Uh Let's just, uh, let's just keep continue playing the game, okay? Ha ha! Ha ha! We're getting close now, Aurelia. Barry, I thought you were AI. I am AI. I'm very complicated AI, apparently. <laughs> The other stones. Oh no, not another one. Another fractured stone. I can feel the energy seeping out. It won't be long before this area becomes too dangerous to travel through. What can we do to stop it? You collected energy on the way here, right? See if you can feed it back into the stone remnants. There might be some strange effects, but nothing too crazy. Nothing bad will happen, right? I keep hearing about this man who's doing horrible things. Aurelia, your concern is touching, but you needn't worry. 
Only good can come of this. The fact that you're a Kaishi, no! 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 We are not breaking the stones, and we are not stealing the energy! No! This is a wholesome game, and we're having a wholesome time! Wholesome! Mm. <laughs> the fact that you are asking the question shows your intentions. You remind me of a young spirit. Curious, compassionate, and trusting to a fault. Though you listen much better than any young spirit I've encountered. Those are all very good traits to have. They'll hold you in good stead. Just be careful that you take care of yourself as well. Not everything around here is a spirit. And with the recent troubles, even some spirits are getting, shall we say, a bit human? Thank you, Lusa. I'll be careful, I, I promise. Good. Now let's see if the stone can be restored. I'll be with you when you need me. Oh, bye, Lusa. Is it natural 
Like the earthquakes and the storms? Or is it something causing the zones to fail? Alright. Do I go this way? It seems old though. The... The... The water... Oh, wait. Ah, cool! Nice little cracking shader going out there on the waterfall. Lovely, lovely. Interesting. I'm not sure where this game is going. But I like it. Oh. Another rock slide blocking the path. Yes, I won't be going this way. I swear the earthquakes are getting worse and worse. I've never been this far from the village. It's feeling less like an adventure and more like a hunter trial. Sure, they can survive in the freezing cold overnight, but I don't have their training. And the further I get from the stone, the colder it gets. Can I really do this? Not much further and I'll definitely be spending the night in the snow. Should I turn back? I don't know how to get home from here. I'm sorry, Esta, if you're waiting at home. I can only go forward from here. Heisey says, yes, Aurelia, eat the stones. Break the stones. Heisey also says, Aurelia, eat the snow, especially the black snow and the yellow snow. Heisey, you are a bad influence. Bad influence! You make me worry. I thought you were nice. I thought you were nice. What a lovely view. I can see the Great Ravine from here. That's good. I can use that as a guide. I'm pretty sure the village is close by. These fishing baskets are too tattered to have been used recently. I'm nice, just not Aurelia. This is the only way forward? That is a really long way down and a very steep slope. I don't think I can walk down or even climb down. It's going to be too slippery. What would Esther do? Okay, let's be honest. She'd do something dumb. Like jumping down and hoping for the best. And everything would be fine once she climbed back up and pushed me down too. Ugh. I'm gonna have to be Esther in this situation. so scary. It's only snowdrop. Nice and soft snow. Just like the ones we play around on, except much bigger. Here goes nothing. is okay. I 
haven't seen one big bear. Well, Kaisi, we don't have bears in Australia. for the ice. But even the ice is beautiful, I guess. Oh no, that's true. That's true, Missy. We uh, we do have drop bears. That is definitely true. That is definitely true. We do have drop bears. My bad, my bad. And I guess a koala is technically a bear. But we also have, ko yeah, we have koalas and we have drop bears. I wonder if this was someone from the village. It doesn't look too old. I must be close. Is there anything else around here? Nope, invisible wall. Bam. Here we go. Ooh, that's a big one. Whoa, this is a long one. Let's do this. Watch me go! Keep their crop. 
crops alive either. Everything's buried. Are there people up there? In the snow and rubble? Where would they all go otherwise? I don't even know if it, any other village is out this way. That's not looking good. Not looking good at all. swallowed everything and the snow covered it all up. Everything has fallen apart. The earthquakes must have been fierce here. Is that? Oh no. This house is utterly destroyed. No one could possibly still be alive. This could be our village soon. I just want to be back home. Kaisi says the spirits wanted her revenge. Kaisi, not everyone thinks like you. The snow's gotten all the way inside some of the buildings. They must have been like this for quite some time. Whoa, it's quaking up here too. I need to stay away from those cliffs. Let's get closer to the cliffs. Help. Aurelia, I see you're so mean. 
mean! You're so mean! You need to go back to the village. You're right. You need to do something. And I'm going to. I'm gonna get you help and find out what's causing all this destruction. I made a mistake. Just let me look after you. It's my turn to look after you. I love you. Trust me. I do. And I love you too. Stay here. I'll get out. All right. Just go, Aurelia. All right, let's go find some help. Help any help? Asta said the rumble came. The rumble came from the mountain. Maybe there's something up there, messing with the stones. There's nothing, and I don't know what I'll do. I need to find out what's up there. It's my only hope for helping Asta and ending this destruction. It's lovely to see Aurelia gain some confidence. Yeah, you can, Aurelia. Chapter 5. No going back. I wonder how many chapters there are. Is there something over here? Nope. Aurelia, fight God. Uh, I mean... I don't, I don't think there'll be any uh, actual fighting in this game. I can't believe I'm gonna do- I'm doing this. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. I don't know how far I have to go. We're just gonna keep going, Aurelia. We're gonna keep going. We gotta do this. Yeah, we're gonna do it. I don't really know what I'm even doing, to be perfectly honest. I don't know if I can get back to the spirit realm and help the spirits there. I'm not even sure if I can figure out what's going wrong with the wrong in the world. I quite like the piano whenever a new text box appears. That's nice. Oh no! Oh, there's something over here. It looks like people used to pass by here. Maybe I'll find help further up, or at least some shelter. This piano is right up my alley. Another rumble! This is definitely not natural. It must be from Iris. Is there another stone further up? Chapter 6. Upward. Into danger. Into danger. Why would anyone be trying to destroy the stones? How is that even possible? Maybe he was trapped in the spirit world and now he's gonna... He's gone mad? Or he's use, He's trying to use the power of the stones to do something. I 
if so, he's made a pretty big mistake. There has been so much destruction. I hope I can help to make things better. from here. What did I do last time? Let's see if this does anything. noise is coming from. It sounds like it's deeper inside the mountain. Ooh, yay, more pretty lights. More pretty lights. Yay, 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 yay. All this uncontained energy is tearing everything apart. Ooh. Hey, it's the spirits! Wait, Aurelia, we're here to help. Luso, I'm so glad to see you. I have some bad news. I passed through a village at the bottom of the mountain. It was in ruins and completely destroyed. Something had torn the place apart. I think that man had something to do with it. Yes, the eat. The eat had devoured the war. We spotted him ahead. We need to focus on how we can stop him now. It won't be easy. He's draining the stones of the last of their power as we speak. We need to hurry and disrupt the foul ritual. But how? The power he must have to cause such destruction. I don't know what I can do. Come, take a look through this gap. Let's work out a plan. Wait, which gap? This gap? Oh, yeah. causing all this noise? How am I supposed to fight that? He's absorbing everything around us. Don't worry, Aurelia. I have an idea. See that pool of energy beneath Iris? You can use that to restore the stones he's draining. Hmm, maybe that will work. What about all the crazy light beams? The other spirits and I should be able to hold them off for a while. 
Have you tried talking to him? No. We were too afraid. Perhaps you would have a chance, Aurelia. If anyone could reason with him, it'd be you. I think... I think I should try. You're braver than a lot of spirits, Aurelia. Thank you. We'll be here to help you if he turns violent. Ah, uh, let's hope it doesn't come to that. I'm scared something bad's gonna happen to Aurelia. Oh, look at the look at the spirits hide. Oh, that's cute. That's cute. But so goes there.
one more to go. It's not too late to stop. Please, listen to me. You're making everything worse. Lightning storms and earthquakes, giant cracks appearing in the ground. The winter weather getting colder and colder. People are dying in the cold, Iris. On my way up the mountain, I even came across an entire village. Completely destroyed and covered in snow. There was no one left. Wait, what? You've seen the village? That's my home. My love? How I miss her. No, 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 you can't trick me. I don't believe you. I'm sorry, it's true. You must believe me. <laughs> Missy says, ah yes, the old, I don't think of a thing, therefore it doesn't work. Shtick. Classic. Why would anything I do affect our world? Your pitiful stories would not sway me. It has to be a lie. It has to be.
Ooh, it's a big one. We did it, Asta. We really did it. It's hard to believe. From a small village girl to defender of the spirits. <laughs> Asta will never believe me. Asta! Oh, I better go back to get her before she freezes. It's gonna take forever to dig her out. Oh yeah, we were meant to go get help, weren't we? If there's one thing I like more than snow, it's greenery. Chapter 8. One Final Farewell. I guess it's that time. I've packed all my gear and said goodbye. The open road beckons. There's just one thing left to do. Aw, oh, this is lovely! Lovely! As terrible as everything was, I'm glad I got to meet the spirits. They were nice, in a crazy sort of way. And their world was so beautiful. Though it was overwhelming at times. In the end, well, I'd do it again if I had to. Knowing the spirits will be safe and able to tend to Mother Earth again, it's nice. Not to mention helping our little village to survive. This game is kind of giving me like journey-esque vibes. I hope the spirits are safe and happy. They taught me so much about finding my path. I'm not afraid of jumping into the deep end and discovering the wonders beneath. Thank you, Luso, for teaching me to embrace the unknown. May we meet again someday. Spirits above, may you keep watch over our village. Especially keep an eye on my sister, Esther. She's bound to do something while I'm gone. Burden of life is to keep on living. After friends and family have long passed on. While our sister village was not well known to me. I still grieve for all those who were lost. May they rest peacefully. Please accept these offerings, Mother Earth. Time to head off. The only question is, Number two. <laughs> Who cares? Anywhere will do. The great unknown beckons. I'm so ready for it.
That was so cute, wasn't it? It was so cute. was definitely something that both Moss and I needed to play today. Well, Moss more than me. Uh, speaking of Moss, how you doing? That was so cute. I loved it. I loved every moment of it. Ah, it was pretty, and it was... Just, I, cute, cute is the best word for it, I think. Missy Cute was definitely the best word for it. Um, uh, hide and seek specialist? Head of Snuggles. Oh, is that all the <laughs> small chief executive? Is that all the, the, the developer's pets' names? That's pretty funny. I shall keep note of that because that is a good idea. No, thank you, uh, Myriad. That was great. That was really, really good. Alright. Okay. So. Let's jump back to this. So, I had a feeling... I had a feeling that this game wasn't going to last the entire stream. So, I have a backup. And uh, let's just say it's not as heartwarming and not as, uh, <laughs> not as calming as that was. But I think I'm ready for it. Um... I was watching uh, another streamer called Lumberjack play this last night. I think it was last night. And, uh... We're gonna be playing. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no, 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 wait. I gotta, I gotta get this set up. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is the game? <laughs> For the rest of the stream, we're gonna be playing getting over it with Ben and Fonny, which is a bit of a left, which is a bit of a left, left, left field turn for the stream. But I think, I think it's definitely, uh, oh, that's very loud. Let me turn that down. Uh, I think, I think we've all calmed ourselves and, uh, gotten ourselves in a, in a good place. Um, so let me adjust the stream. Uh, da, da, da. all right. I have not played this game. I have not played this game. So, uh, uh, what's it? Yeah, lumberjack gaming. Missy, if you want to chuck, if you want to chuck, I think there might be there. He might be streaming at the moment. I think he's playing Apex or something. But if you want to chuck a, a link to his channel in the chat, um, I have not played this. But I've seen a lot of people play it. So let's see how it goes. Yeah, that's Jason's mate. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Which, by the way, getting over it is also an Australian game, if you didn't know. I'm actually, I'm pretty sure it is. I hope it is. Let's see what all the, uh, the fuss is about, shall we? All right. Oh god. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> it just like as soon as it touches something, it instantly. Oh no. Mm. Woo. Okay. All right. That was a good start. That was a good start. All right. Let me turn the game up just a little bit more. Just a little bit more. Oh, I can't do that. I'm gonna have to pull myself over just a little bit. Just a little bit. Get over it. Get over it. Get over it. 
Whack. Oh, there we go. Okay, there we go. There we go. There we go. There we go. I'll quickly jump on my laptop to grab his handle. Oh, no, that's a good. Take your time. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, wow. It, it, it. There's no feeling more intense than Hi. starting over. If you deleted your homework the day before it was due, as I have, or if you left your wallet at home and you have to go back after spending an hour in the commute. If you want some money at the casino, and you put all your winnings on red, but it came up black. Oh, I hate it when that happens. If you got your best shirt dry cleaned before a wedding, yeah, and best... then immediately dropped food on it. Yep. Oh, if you want an argument with a friend, and then later discovered that they just returned to their original view, starting over is harder than starting up. No! If you're not oh, ready for that, like if you've already had a bad day, then what you're about to go through might be too much. Yeah, Feel I didn't have away necessarily a bad day, but... I'll be here. I feel like I'm ready after. Whoop. All right. Thanks for coming with me on this trip. I'll understand if you have to take a break at any point. Eh. Just find a safe place to stop and quit nope. the game. Don't worry. I'll save your progress always, even your mistakes. Oh, thanks. Thanks, Bennett. Real, really appreciate it, buddy. This game is a homage nope. to a free game that came out in 2002. Sexy hiking. Sexy hiking. Sexy hiking. The author of that game was Jazuo, a mysterious Czech designer Jazuo. who was known at the time as the father of bee games. Ah. And bee games are rough assemblages of found objects. Designers slap them together very quickly and freely, and they're often too rough and unfriendly to gain much of a following. Uh. They're built more for the joy of building them than as polished products. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, it's, yeah it's come here. Whoop. Yep. 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 Oh, no, no, no. Okay, get on the rock and then go flippy. Oh, no, damn it. No. Wait. 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 Shit. Oh, oh, eh. No, we're in a good position here. Yep. Oh. Oh, no, no. No, oh. no, 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 no. Oh, shit, fuck. Mega bang. Whatever. Oh. Shit. Oh, <laughs> you just lost a lot of progress. No, that wasn't a lot of That's progress. That's a deep frustration. A real punch in the gut. I feel like you're not trying to help me feel better here, Bennett. Not really. I feel like you have ulterior motives in the words you say. Get up, bat, blip, 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 blip. Oh no. And oh no. 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 I don't know if I have the commands of so. But yeah, if anyone's watching, check out that streamer name. Good lad. Guy's name's Carl. Has a beard. Can recommend. Also Australian. One of uh, Missy's husband's friends. <clears throat> Just a delightful human being. <gasps> oh, that was heavy. I don't, can I Can I slowly pull myself up here? Oh, I can. I can. Can I? Can I? No. Oh, shit. Oh, big swing. Big swing. Damn it. It's... Oh, Jesus. It's so hard to get up that bit there. Oh, okay. There we go. Thank you, Missy. Oh, so close. Uh, oh, so close. Hmm. No! <clears throat> Missy, out of curiosity, if I ever did a... If I ever wrote and streamed a one-shot um, of D&D, would you be interested in playing? I'm thinking... I'm thinking... Um, like, I think maybe... Manda and maybe some of the bees would be interested in in doing like a one shot at some point. Yes, big capital letters. And I think like with you, the bees and uh, 
<clears throat> you, the bees, and Manda, that would probably be enough people. Would that be something... Oh. <gasps> no! Fuck. Uh. Alright. I'm getting disappointed but not frustrated yet. Not yet. Not yet. But yes, it will definitely not be any... T oh! Oh! I'm desperate not to play it all. Desperate not to play it all. <gasps> yes! Alright, alright, alright. Don't fuck this up, Moss. In a certain way, <gasps> Sexy Hiking is the perfect embodiment of a bee game. It's built almost entirely out of found and recycled parts, and it's one of the most unusual and unfriendly games of its time. In it, your task is simply to drag yes. yourself up a mountain with a hammer. And that act of climbing in the digital world or in real life, Jokes has aside, certain essential properties Great. that give the awesome. game I haven't written it yet. I have no some No amount ideas. of forward progress is guaranteed. And because some, some, of, some of them haven't... Some are too sheer or too slippery. And the player is constantly, to to unremittingly in danger of falling and losing everything. Um, uh, some people haven't played, so it'd probably be like an intro to D&D sort of a one-shot. But I have other... Anyway, when you start <gasps> sexy hiking... You're standing next to this dead tree that blocks the way to the entire rest of the game. It might take you an hour to get over that tree. And a lot no, of people didn't take never me got past it. You didn't take me that long. and you poke at it, exploring the limits oh of your gosh. reach and oh your strength, gosh. trying to find a way up and over. And there's a sense of truth in that lack of compromise. Most obstacles in video game worlds are fake. You can be completely I'm confident in your ability to get far. through them. Once you have the correct method yes. or the correct equipment or just by spending enough time. Oh my in gosh. that sense, oh my every gosh. pixelated obstacle in Sexy Hiking is real. The obstacles in Sexy Hiking are unyielding, and that makes the game uniquely frustrating. Oh, no, no, no. But I'm not sure Jazuo intended to make a frustrating game. The frustration is just essential to the act of climbing, and it's authentic to the process of building a game about climbing. A funny thing happened to me as I was building this mountain. No. Nope. I'd have an idea for a new obstacle, and I'd build it, test it, and it would usually turn out to be unreasonably hard. Oh my gosh, I don't know but how I But I couldn't I just bring myself to make it easier. It already felt like my inability to get past a new no! obstacle was my fault, as a player rather than as a builder. Imaginary mountains Grab build it. themselves from Grab our it. efforts to climb Grab them. This is definitely And the it's our repeated it attempts to reach the summit oh, that no. turns those mountains into something real. When you're building a video game world, we go, you're building go, with ideas. Reset and that mouse. can be like working with quickset cement. You mold your ideas into a certain shape that can be played with. Oh. And in the process of playing with them, they begin to harden and set no. until they're immutable, like rock. And at that point, you can't change the world. Not without breaking it into pieces and starting fresh with new ideas. Damn it. I thought, I honestly, watching other people play this, I thought this little bit here would be harder. But, uh, it's actually, it, it, it's simpler than I expected it to be. Ah! Oh, no, 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 no. I've got to be careful. I don't want to lose any of this progress. I fluked my way up until this point. I have fluked it. Oh. There we go. That's what I wanted. Yes. Yes. All right, all right, all right. <gasps> nope. All right, I'm going to just pull myself just a little bit to the left here. There we go. There we go. Ooh. No! <gasps> no! No, 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 Oof, no, 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 no! Damn you, Bennett. Damn you, Bennett, Foddy. Foddy Doddy. Oh no. Alright, 
right, get some get some leverage. Nope, we go. Nope. Nope. And up we go. Yeah, get some leverage. Get some le ah. Nope, that's not what I wanted to do. Not what I there we go. Oh no, that would have been perfect. Damn it. Damn it. There we go, there we go, there we go, there we go, there we go. Come on. No, up, up, up. There we go. Oh, shit. Oh, hello. And it... No, no! Ah, oh, damn it. There we go. There we go. Whoa! Right up, up, up. And uh, down, down, down. And we're gonna launch, gonna launch, launchy! There we go. Cool. All right, we're back here. We're back here now. We're back here now. Oh, nice. No, come down. Come down. Damn it. All right. There we go. Nope. 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 Nakusta. Nope. 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 Relax, Moss. Relax. Relax. It's all good, buddy. It's all good, buddy. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. No. 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 There we go. There we go. Ooh. No. Okay. There we go. There we go. Oh, shit. What's annoying about this bit is that it is completely random if you get... Oh, no. No, fuck. Damn it. It is com almost completely random. <coughs> getting this bit. Correct. No! Oh, I had to move my mouse. Up a little bit. And then a launch. Come on. Come on. Okay, I've learnt, I've learnt that I will go over the edge here. I need to be very, very careful. As opposed to not being careful during the rest of the game. Okay, alright, this is exactly where I want to be. It's the way I want to be. Yes! For years now, ha -ha. people have been predicting that <laughs> games would soon be made out of prefabricated objects bought in a store, and assembled into a world. And for the most part, that hasn't happened. Because the objects in the stores are trash. Okay, apparently I don't mean this they is look a bad or that they're bit. badly made, although a lot of them are. I mean they're trash in the way that food becomes trash as soon as you put it in the sink. Things are made to be consumed and used in a certain context. And once the moment is gone, they transform into garbage. In the context of technology, those moments pass by Shit. in seconds. Oh, down we go, down we go. Get that launch. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> no! What? No! No! <laughs> what? Oh my god. Okay. Alright. I'm, 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 I'm rushing this bit. I'm rushing. Let's go. What? Fuck. <laughs> All right, it's the it's 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 the the f the frantic swell of the axe or the the hammer, and then slamming against the wall. That's what's that's what's fucking me here. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Got it. Right. There. We, oh, okay. All right, all right. I'm getting I'm getting the hammer in the right spot there. Oh shit. Okay. <clears throat> Oh, oh, that was good. That was good. Also, I can probably chuck the uh, chat box back up. There we go. Ah, damn it. That push off. Oh, there's a lot of wall to scale before you get to a save point. So many, so many places you can make a mistake. Ah, shit. Oh, oh. What? What? Damn it. Oh. Shit. 
Uh, could I launch myself here? Could I just... No, no. Not worth it. I'll just do this again. Ah, bugger. Shit. Position mouse before jumping again. Whoop. Oh. oh, oh, yeah, I know, right, mate? No, mm. that's disappointing. That's a that's a big old slap in the crutch. That's a. That's a that's a big ol' that's a big ol' spit in the face right there. Oh. Shit. Every now and then you've gotta like just release a bit of frustration and just do a few wild attempts. Oh. There. Alright, okay, that's enough. That's enough. Let's get back to being serious. No. Oh. Bugger. Oh, oh. ah. There. Yep. Yep, 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 yep. Whoop. Yep. Yep. Ugh. Whoop. <gasps> I was not expecting that to work first try. Over time, we've poured more and more refuse into this vast digital landfill that we call the internet. It now vastly outnumbers and outweighs the things that are fresh and untainted and unused. When everything around us is cultural trash, trash becomes the new medium, the lingua franca of the digital age. And you can build culture out of trash. But only no! trash culture. B games, B movies, B music, B philosophy. Fuck! Maybe this is what digital culture <sighs> is. A monstrous mountain of trash, the ash heap of creativity's fountain. You're a monstrous a landfill mountain with everything of trash. we ever thought of in it. Grand, infinite. And unsorted. Whoop. Trash. Let's turn the game down just a tiny little bit. Okay. All right. All right. Ah, fuck. And yeah. no. Ah. Oh. Okay. All right. We got it. We got it. We got it. Grab that, lower ourselves down, beautiful, and then get a nice swing. The vertical wall here has a way of getting harder the more times you try it. At no the end, it makes shit. You swing the hammer harder, and that can push you away from the wall. Oh, well, that that worked out. That worked out. No, that did not work out. Ah, shit. Go, no, go back the other way. Go back the other way. Uh, actually, I might put on my own music. Can I? Well, yeah, 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 all that stuff. Uh, music volume. Let's turn that down. Let's turn the voiceover down a little bit. Apply, resume, and let's turn my own music back up. There you go, some nice, calming music. Oh, it didn't go all the way around. This worked last time, so I'm gonna try this again. Mm. 
Sweet. Shit. So there's little nudges in the walls that... That are... That are... Pushes you away. That you don't intend for the hammer to grab onto. Nope. Time. It's time for cat time, everyone. I, I, actually, how about no? Because he ran away from me. No cat time. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Oh hi, buddy. Actually. scratch for him. Hey, how did the stream, buddy? <gasps> no! <laughs> I tried to full screen the webcam and I forgot the game was still connected to the mouse. <laughs> no! <sighs> well, I'm not going to make that all for nothing. Say hi to the stream, buddy. He's a cute boy. Look at him. Alright, bye, buddy. See ya. <sighs> Alright. All right, we are literally back at the start now. this time there we go that's what I wanted yeah, grab this like precisely set up like the different crevices of the different objects like I wonder how much actual game design he put into this strategically
That's fine. That's fine. That's fine. Let's get ourselves set up here. There you go. Get ourselves set up again. Nope. Oh. Nope. Okay, I lost it. I lost it. That's fine. Let's prep. There we go. There we go. There we go. There. Pull ourselves in. Lovely. Push myself off here. Push myself off. Come on. No! Doing pretty well. Doing pretty. Nope. Yeah, I'm not gonna. Oh, hello. All right. Slowly. Slowly. And launch. There we go. All right. All right. We're back. We're back. We're back. We're back. We're back to this shit again. All right. Uh. <laughs> that guy's noise. Ah. Uh. God damn it. what people that's the content people really want to see they don't want to see see anyone succeed at this game they want to see people fall they want they want to see people fall and get angry that's what that's what that's what people really want to see with this sort of a game
Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. That's a good hook on the edge. That's exactly what I wanted. No, don't get greedy, Moss. Don't get greedy. That's what I wanted. No! Country road, take me home to the place I belong. West Virginia. Oh, there's, 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 there's people singing. I thought this was instrumental music. Oh, there goes the mug. Whoop. Oh, there it is. No! You gotta spasm, spasmly move your mouse to get it in position for the lamp. Shit. I was wondering if this game would make me frustrated, and so far it hasn't. It's disappointed me. I'm more so in myself. But, um... I'm actually doing fine. Like, I'm, I'm viewing this as more of a challenge than anything. Like, I'm getting similar challenge vibes to, like, games like Hades and Cuphead. 
Don't jinx it? No, I'm not going to jinx it. I mean, I am definitely going to get angry at this game at some point. But... Ah, oh, shit. Like, I, I, that, it's definitely going to happen. I just haven't got there yet. And I thought I would get there sooner than I have. Or sooner than I... I thought I'd get there by now. There we go. English. Shout out, Bennett. No. Ah. It's like when you go throw a basketball. As soon as it leaves your hands, or as soon as you, like, do the thing, the launch, the throw, or whatever it is, you know it's going to be bad. Missy, out of curiosity, um, just for, you know, getting research about the one shot, what what are your favorite D D settings? Um Do you like cities? Do you like forests? Do you like going full fantasy or do you like a little bit of realism, kinda like uh um uh, uh steampunky or anything like that? What's your ideal set Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. God, come here. If anything, this is hurting my arm. It's hurting my shoulder. stuck there for a second. Alright, all right. cool, 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 cool. Up we go. I am usually partial to... Because I've been running a D&D &D campaign set in a major metropolis city, and I'm pretty keen to go somewhere, like, in a forest. Like a simpler setting. Uh, Missy says, I mean, my only really real experience with D&D is Critical Role, but if I had to say, for a one-shot, either something town-centred or full wilds. Yeah, no, nah, that's where I'm thinking as well. Something small town, village, related. Is it cool? Oh, okay, all right, so we're back here. Nope, there it is. The way that music just, like, deteriorated is very much my uh, mentality right now. Shit. Nah. What kind of, out of curiosity, what's your kind of, what's, Missy, what's your go-to, what's your go-to class or race? Or what would be your go-to class or race? Like one of our one of our players on the in the campaign that I run at the moment, he is loving being a halfling right now because you can roll every one, re-roll every one, which is an insane ability to have. It's insane. Emily is always rogue, not always, but like that's her thing. Rogue is definitely her her personality. Um. She played a tabaxi rogue in the last campaign that we did. My my class and race for last campaign was halfling 
No, I think it was gnome, gnome, uh, gnome wizard. And I had a lot of fun with that because that was higher level. Oh, that's a good question. If I'm going to do it, because it's the thing about playing with people who are, who are trying out D&D for the first time. Um, is that do you go slightly higher level so they have more hit points and more things to do? They can take a couple of beatings. Shit. Um, or do you stay low so it keeps it simple for them? That's the thing. Uh, Miss says I would probably play a rogue or maybe a warlock as for a race. Depends on what's allowed. Uh, I'm pretty, I'm pretty easy. When it, especially if it's a one shot. I just, whatever you want, really. <laughs> But why not? There's so many cool, like, playable races now. Especially on D&D Beyond. D&D Beyond! Damn it. Rogue sounds good. Damn it. I've got to... Alright, I've got to do it in such a way where I'm not going to... The cauldron. The body is not going to hit the wall. By the way, is uh, Missy? Can you clarify for me? Is the stream saying that I'm playing get, playing get it over getting getting over it, or is it still saying that I'm playing uh, where the snow settles? <gasps> no! Oh. Uh, it says you're playing getting over it. Okay, thank you, Trashy. Trashy? Trash, trash A? Trash A? Ah. Bugger. By the way, I'm loving this music right now. Thanks, League of Legends. Uh, Miss says, on mine being mobile, it says the old game title, but I don't think it updates on phone. Oh, really? Yeah. Twitch's mobile app, not the greatest. As well, because, like, if you go to the subscription system as well for mobile is also bizarre, and I don't understand why it's different. Shit. Oh. Shit. Uh, you can try and spin your hammer in a clockwise direction really fast to get up this part, but whenever you're more comfortable with. Alright. Just like frantically spinning it. <laughs> oh god. I mean, part of that is working. Trashy, have you played this game before? Shit. 90 plus... Wait, 90 plus times? You've beaten it 90 plus times? Or you've played it 90 plus times? 
<laughs> yes, okay. <laughs> yes to both those things. <gasps> no. <laughs> Beaten at 90 plus times. Oh my god. That is uh this impressive. That is this is my first time playing this. And I've always been curious. I've watched plenty of people play this, but I've always been curious to see just how difficult this game is. And it's obviously muscle memory, which is why I'm not getting too frustrated. It's the same with, like I was saying before, it's the same with games like Cuphead and Hades and all those other games that are challenged-based. It's just getting to the point where... It's getting to the point where, yeah, it's just muscle memory. You're just getting used to how the game works, how it flows. Ugh. All right, guess who showed up? All right, I'm going to go over here so I don't fuck the game up. But I think it's time for a break and a cat cam. Time for cat cam. Say hi, buddy. Say hi, Rory. He was in the process of pullish, pushing that uh, bottle top off. <laughs> Not interested in a pat. Oh, wait, here he goes. He is definitely the cutest cat in the world. <laughs> there it goes. No, <laughs> oh, he's so cute. Look at the way he wraps his tail around his legs. Missy, can I get a can I get a meow? Can I get a meow channel points reward? <clears throat> meow. Did the face not appear again there? That's really annoying. <laughs> you door cats, well, you've come to the right place. <gasps> Brendan, ah, us. This must be the weekly scheduled Rory Cam at 9.34 p.m. That is exactly, exactly, br exactly the thing. It did at the bottom? Oh, good. I missed it. I didn't see it. Brendan, how the bloody hell are you, mate? Welcome, welcome. How has your week been so far, my good sir? <laughs> Heck yeah, some Bennett Foddy. Oh, you bet, buddy. You bet we've got some Bennett Foddy going on in the house. This is the first time I'm playing this. Hello. Hello. Hello! <sighs> Did that sound make a weird sound before it started playing? Because in my ears it did. Uh, your week has been pretty good so far. That's good. I'm glad. I'm glad your week has been good. Did you turn off Bennett's voice? I turned it down. But it hasn't. It just hasn't played for a while. I guess I haven't progressed in the game enough to... Uh, to... No! <sighs> but yeah, no subtitles have, 
have come up for a little bit, so. Uh -huh. No! No! Oh. Alright, I'm gonna do this instead. There we go. Oh. Ah! The way that it bounces off the edge is very, very agitating. Doesn't it trigger whenever you hit the bottom again or hit a sort of milestone? Yeah, no, it does. And like I said, I haven't, I haven't gotten higher. I've gotten uh, uh, past this obstacle. Like, I've gotten past this wall before. Um, and I've only fallen down to the bottom a couple of, like, the absolute bottom a couple of times. No! Sprout, how's it going? Welcome, welcome. Also, I didn't do that for Brendan either. Brendan, hello. Trashy, good to have you here. Hello, hello, hello. How the bloody hell are you, Sprout? Brendan, Sprout, Trashy, you just before y'all showed up, we were playing a game before called uh, Where the Snow Falls, which uh, recently came out. Um, and was developed by a small indie team in Tasmania. And it was lovely. You woke up from a nap. That sounds delightful. Was it a good nap? It looks, it sounds like it was a good nap, Sprout. You've come to the most calming, stress-free stream uh, possible. Damn it, damn it, damn it. Oh, hell yeah, it was a very good nap. Yeah, I can't get into naps. Like, I can see why people like them, and the idea of having a little sleep in the middle of the day, that seems, like, reasonable, right? That seems like a reasonable thing to enjoy. I just don't enjoy them. I have, I go to sleep, and I, I have a nap, I wake up, and I'm even more tired. Getting over it, my detested. Sprout, have you played this? Have you played this? And yeah, this is, and then and then there's the part of me. There's the uh, the uh, the overworking uh, perfectionist part of me. That's like, why would I waste my time having a nap when I could do other games? You require naps to function. That's for yeah, and that's fair enough. That's that's completely fine. I just I've just never I've just never been a napper. Emily isn't. Emily doesn't wait. The game's on my wish list, but my chat doesn't does want me to play it. Yes, no. I imagine any chat, any person's community would want a streamer to play this game. Because yeah, oh fuck. It is exactly the thing you want. You know, frustration, you know, anger, people people getting angry, people redeeming channel points. No! Hello, Accurate. Welcome back, buddy. Uh, it's pretty cheap, though. It's like 11 bucks. 11 or 12 bucks, so. Australian, anyway. Come here. Come here. Come on. Come here. Come here. I just watched In the Shadows. Have you not seen... Wait. Oh, you watched In the Shadows. You never left. You don't have the game. Yeah. Lurking in the shadows. Like Batman. Or a shadow. <laughs> You're a shadow within the shadows. But yeah, Sprout, tell me tell me about what's going on. What's what's been what's the what's the happy hap? What's been going on? Uh, will you be able to stream it if you somehow get it? That is uh, accurate talking to Sprout, I believe. Alright, alright, alright. <gasps> alright, 
hold your breath, everyone. Oh. No! Bugger. Also, I should start getting quieter. It's nearly 10 o'clock here. Uh, Sprout said, you bet? Yeah, ever since chat experienced a bit of Sprout baby rage, they've wanted to see me suffer. Especially if your uwu channel points <laughs> award was redeemed. That would be hilarious. Uh, that's another thing. Not sure if my laptop can handle it. Oh, it could it, it would definitely be able to handle this. This it, your it would be fine. If your laptop can handle Minecraft, it can handle this. Shit. I'm getting better? Nope. <laughs> As I say that. Oh god, not Uwu. It's funny, we create these channel points for ourselves. Oh, no! I got to the end! There he is. There is Bennett. The unlimited Uwu redeems. Okay, I am getting better. I am getting the hang of it. Instead of swinging it all the way to the right to hook onto things, I'm just doing it up and then up and then a bit. Up and then a bit. Bennett's really quiet. Yeah, no, I turned him down. Because he was talking a lot. Yeah, I'll turn him up again. Wait, was that... Yeah, that worked. Just because I have uh, other music going on. Also, he was talking a lot at the beginning. No! <sighs> this song reminds me of Adventure Time. Uh, Sprout or Accurate, have you, have either of you, we were talking about D&D &D before, have either of you played any Dungeons and Dragons? Shit. And if not, is that something, is that, is that something you'd like to get into at some point? Shit. You've never played it? Oh, that's really sad. It makes me so sad when people haven't played Dungeons and Dragons, which, to be fair, would probably be a lot of people, but it still, it makes me sad. Nah, bugger. Damn it. Uh, you got into a group, but they, you never got to play it. That is literally the biggest flaw with Dungeons & Dragons. Is, neat, is like having people to play with. And not only that, preferably people who kind of know how to play. Or at least one person. And then you need someone to run it. It's a... Shit. Wow, that was a really big launch you really i really want i really want to do yeah no especially as soon as you start getting a group together it gets very exciting and then when it doesn't happen like i run a group at the moment um uh, like i've i've taken the the dungeon master baton um this time around um and even even though we are all relatively experienced in D D half the time we don't have sessions just because, you know, schedules don't line up. To be fair, there are six players and myself as the DM, so there's seven of us in total, so that's a lot. Um, one day I'll play D&D. Brendan, you will play D&D. As my friend, I will make sure that you play D&D at some point in your life. Shit. Uh, the D&D curse of never being able to schedule, exactly. Shit. Ah, oh, damn it. Thanks, but Brendan, you're absolutely welcome. It will happen. Just like you'll get me that USB back one day. It will happen. Maybe that's what we'll that's what we'll have to do. I have to run a game of D and D for you to give me back that USB. Is Emily awake? Uh she probably is. She's probably playing Stardew.
Ah, damn it. This wall is infuriating. And Carl from Lumberjack Gaming also said this was a difficult bit. And I agree with him. Damn it. Brendan says, I've been meaning to ask her if she likes Ginger's latest song. Oh, that's right. I don't know if she knows. She's on a major BTS binge at the moment. Uh, it's quite severe, actually. Um, so uh, I don't know if she notices knows if there's a new Ginger song. How new is it? Uh, Missy says, when you do this one shot, will it be done on like roll 20 or something? Possibly. Um, there's a there's a program that a friend of mine gifted me that's on Steam called Tailspire. And the program is a way to create 3D... <gasps> Hold that thought. Hold that thought, everyone. Hold that thought. It's a couple of weeks old. Yeah, she may have not noticed it. Yes. Oh my gosh. Finally. All right. So I'm going to pay attention to this for a bit. <gasps> Finally. Thank you, Trashy, for your patience. That probably was... Oh, my God. As someone who's finished this 90 plus times, it must be... Actually, no. I don't, I don't feel happy about that. I'm going to reposition my hammer. There we go. There we go. All right, all right. Now, don't fault. No, don't jinx it, Missy. All right, all right. Carefully, carefully. Accurate. Of course you would say that. You are evil. All right, now I know there is a shortcut here, but I'm going to go the normal way just so I've experienced it. 3D models of breakfast. All right. Gen X's fanfic novels, scan magazines, green screen. Man's upper body strength is wild. Oh yeah. Ducks go raw. Facebook That's what I was thinking. With unbranded adverts yep. and candid shots of Kanye and Taylor Swift mashups, car crash epic failed gifs, Russian dash cam vids, discussions of McRibs, discarded, forgotten, unrecycled, muddled, rotten, untied. <gasps> Oh god, oh, get back up there. There we go. Sit nice and s sit nicely on sit nicely on the barbecue, muscle man of the cauldron. Uh ducks go raw. Hello, hello. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. Uh, welcome to the part you will spend 60% of the game. Don't tell me that, Trashy. Don't tell Everything's me that. Everything's fresh for about six seconds until some newer thing beckons and we hit refresh. And there's years of persevering, disappearing I'm into the pile. I'm close to this so I can hook onto this better. Out of sight. Benna, shut up. I'm just going to take my time here. I'm just going to take my time here. Alright. <gasps> yes! This has gone well. So far. And this has kind of been how it's happened for me. I start off really, really well and fluke it. And then I fall. And then I struggle. Are people playing Revert You Know in the chat? If so, can I play? In this context, it's tempting to make friendly content that's gentle, that lets you churn through it but not earn it. Why make something demanding if it just gets piled up in the landfill? All right. Do I go down landfills? here? Do I go down? Is it trashy? Do I go down here? Yes, you fall. That's what I thought. I'm going to try and push myself here. No house rules. Always house rules. Do, do any of you play, you know, 
<laughs> okay. Wait, 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 wait. There we go. All right. Do any of you play the rule where if you if you play a seven, you have to trade hands with someone else that you choose, and if you play a zero, everyone uh, trades hands in the direction the in the direction the game is being played at that current time. All right. All right, all right, all right. Oh, that is far too close <gasps> to the edge there. Oh, he's right there! 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 Oh, oh my god! He's coming for me! He's coming for me! Oh my god! Open the door! Open the door! Open the door! Open the door. Open the door. <laughs> it's it's oh long! It's long! <laughs> Yes, but Trashy, that is the best way to play Uno. Without a doubt. You've never heard of those rules, Ducks? Oh, you need to play a game of Uno with those rules. It's so good. It is so good. Also, you can jump in. If you've got the same number and color, then the card that's currently on top of the pile in the middle, you can jump in even if it's not your turn. And then it goes and continues on from you. Uh, Brendan says in the rules where you have the same number. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. All right. I don't know the best way to go about this. The pain I feel now is the happiness I had before. That's the deal. All right. C.S. Lewis. That's fine. I'm fine with that because I know that there's a shortcut here. I know there's a shortcut here. I feel here. within me a peace above all earthly dignities. A still okay, tip for this way, you just want to jump in the sit. Yeah. William Shakespeare. Exactly. Yep, 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 yep. I've, I've seen a few people do this. Should save us some time. Uh, now let's get a let's get the the hammer on the edge here, so I can get some good leverage. Nope. Oh, shitty. You cannot now believe that you will ever feel better, but this is not true. You're sure to be happy again. Bennett. And knowing this, truly Bennett. believing it will make you less miserable Bennett. now. No. Abraham Lincoln. I don't care. Oh, that was close. That was close. That was close. Also, is there music playing still? No, I turned that off. Good. <laughs> nope. Nope, 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 nope. Nope. <sighs> oh, nah. Get back up there, mate. Get back up there. Oh, so close. So close. So close. I gotta. I can't just swing around in a circle because I need that. I need height. I need that height. You bought like four packs of Uno for a Mega Deck. Oh yeah, no, you can't play with one deck. You gotta play with at least two, or at least two. Ah, oh, damn it. Nope. 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 Whoop. Uh, have any of you played a game, a board game called Dominion? Um, do you have trackpad turning on? No, I'm using a mouse. Does that make a difference? Dominion? It is by far... <gasps> No! Oh, no! Oh. Stop it! I'm trying to accurate. I'm trying to. No! Oh. Well, now I know it can be Stop done. Stop it! <laughs> nah. Now I know I can do it. 
Oh, that was close. How are you all three of you there now when you in? Sprout! Thank you! You bloody legend! Thank you so much, Sprout! Aww. Thank you so much, Sprout. I really appreciate that. Aww. An absolute legend. Absolute legend. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> Meow. <laughs> oh, nuts. Trying to remember what I did. <gasps> Trashy! Thank you for the follow. Thank you, thank you. And thanks for helping out, by the way. Really appreciate it. Nah, fuck. Do not stand at my grave and cry. Bennett, shut up. I am not there. I did not die. Community emotes. Oh, accurate. That's beautiful. I love that. Ah, oh, damn it, so close. To live is to suffer. No, Bennett, to no. To survive is to find no. some meaning in the suffering. Go away. Friedrich Nietzsche. I just got to sub to bees and that's it. And then, then you have completely uh, unlocked the uh, Triforce. Life is a of pleasure and pain. Grief. Is There's a trigger in this part. Yes, I, I'm picking that up this now. Is the interlude between two wars. The game developer inside no me understands. Tool. The diligent picker will avoid the And that is and very annoying. And you know, part of me Sankia thinks he did that on purpose. Ah, oh, I thought I had it rare. Sorrow is my own. No. <laughs> the new grass flames as Let it has it. flamed often before. But not with the cold no fire one cares. that closes around me this year. William Carlos Williams. <sighs> Does that because it thinks you fell from the stairs? So it's a th yeah, yeah, exactly. I I can imagine where he set up the invisible triggers for that to happen. You need a drinking game for when he says certain quotes. Oh, mate. If if I was not working early tomorrow morning, I would definitely do that. Chances are I could do that. But not this stream. Alright, I'm going to go the other way. Actually, no. I'm safe here. What am I talking about? I'm safe here and attempting it here. <laughs> Gotta catch them all. That's exactly right, Sprout. Maybe the suffering one about niche. Ah, uh, yeah, true. Has he repeated a few multiple times already? Shit. Alright, alright. Damn it. Nope, no, no, too far. There we go, that's good. Mm. Nope. Ah, damn it. I'm wonder. I wonder. Is it possible to do it this way? Oh, but Moss, don't you want to risk falling all the way down? No, Missy, I don't. I really don't. No, thank you. No, no. Not sure I haven't heard any doubles yet. Oh, good. That's good, though. Whoop. Whoop. But it's for the content. Missy, get some help. Stop it. Stop. Get some help. No. 
Oh shit. Of all sad words. Oh shut up, Benny. Pin, the saddest of these. It might have been. Meow. Greenleaf Whittier. Meow, exactly. Ah, uh, good now. Nah, I'm trying the other way. Please, audiences. Yes, I'm trying to please. I'm trying to please my audience right now. It can only mean that you have no respect for them. Missy, oh, oh, I'm so sorry. That's not what I meant. Oh shit. Oh no. Oh, 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 no. That's a negatory. Just have a little giggle. Oh, good. I'm glad. I'm glad. I'm glad you're having a giggle. <laughs> oh. Oh. <gasps> no! <laughs> Don't hate the player. I hate the game. Ice tea. Why did I even try? Why did I try? Why did I even try? Oh, I'm so sorry, Trashy. <laughs> The views of what the viewers have already dropped down. <laughs> oh, no. I'm so sorry, everyone. Do you say g'day like g'day or like good day? I say g'day. <laughs> Brendan, you only just noticed. I say g'day. Oh, okay. All right, everyone. Um. I'm going to have a break. You can hit the escape key if you need to change the mouse. Shut up, Benny. Uh, it's time for Barry to try it out. Um, so uh, make sure make sure Barry is given a warm welcome. Um, I'll probably only go for about another... Or the stream will only go for about another 20 minutes, half an hour, something like that. Uh, Barry, have a go, mate. Good luck. Okay. Oh. Oh. Hi, everybody. Hello. What's going on? Hey, Sprout. Hey, Accurate Brendan, Trashy, Missy. Hey, everybody. All right, let's get this game shot. Thank you, Missy. Thank you. Good to be back. Good to be back. Ah, oh, this doesn't look so hard. This doesn't look so hard. Oh, Barry had no eyes for a sec. Yeah, no, no, they were just loading. <laughs> Time to interrogate Barry Brendan. Brendan, behave. I'm trying to play a game here. Barry was shy. I have my moments. Nope. Okay. When to the sessions of sweet silence. Shut call, up, Betty. I summon up remembrance of things past. I sigh the lack of many a thing I saw, and with old woes new, wail my dear time's Fuck. waste. William Shakespeare, Sonnet Day. <laughs> Sprout says, look, I made a cameo on the game. <laughs> the flowers on that rock. What? Sprout, I didn't know you were game famous. As well as stream famous. Patience Fuck. is the foundation of eternal peace. Make anger your enemy. Harm comes to those who know only victory and do not know defeat. Find fault with yourself and not with others. It's in falling short of your own goals that you'll surpass those who exceed theirs. Tokugawa Ieyasu. Okay, that beautiful, lovely. Ah, 
Uh, yeah, there's a bit of moss on these rocks, so he's he's in this game as well. I'm just too popular. You are, Sprout. You're very popular. You're just so lovely. Okay, easy, easy. There we go, there we go. I picked up a few tips from when Moss was playing. You're just too badass, bro. Very badass. Very badass. Okay, so this area is fine. This area seems fine. Is your content? It is very chef's kiss, Sprout. Your content is very chef's kiss. Mwah, mwah, mwah. Okay, all right, and get into position and get into a better position. Kirby Sanders, what? Oh, by the way, Sprout, how is your uh, seducing of Colonel Sanders on the stream? Please not again. All right, all right. I won't. I won't, I won't ask about it. Yeah. So this area is fine. All right. I gotta be careful here. Gotta be careful here. Little bits. Oh, thank you, Brendan, for the little bits. You became business partners and life partners. Ah, oh, that's a beautiful story. With all the spiciness that Colonel Sanders can bring, that only Colonel Sanders can bring, all seven of the spiciness. All right, easy, easy. There we go. Beautiful, lovely. So close on the first try. Ah, so close again. You want to see Kirby Sanders again? No, please. I haven't even seen it and I don't want to look at it again. Oh, is it 11? Oh, my bad. He's back. Brendan, I'm sorry. I haven't eaten KFC before. Oh, fuck yeah. yeah. Meow indeed, Dashy. That went very, very well. We're almost back to where we were. Oh, I gotta get closer to that. I gotta get closer than that. Do robots need to eat? No, I'm good. I like the idea of food. Lovely, lovely. One more hop. Okay, okay. Now we ease. Now we ease. Okay, I'm... Okay, now we ease. Ease it. Ease it. Ease it. Lovely. Easy. Wonderful! Yay! Why was the IT guy in the hospital? He f touched the firewall. Ah, ha, 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 ha. That's funny. All right, we're gonna go. I saw what Moss did, and I'm not gonna do what he did. So we're gonna keep trying to do this bit. Oh, that was close. That was close on the first try. Smiled in defeat. Oh, shut up, Bennett. Conquerable eyes. Atticus. Ah, 
Fuck. Your failure here is a metaphor to learn for what? Failure? Please resume climbing. Failure? Failure, Metafoddy? Tell you what, I've not failed. Yes, I fail when I give up. And I'll tell you now, Benefoddy, I will not be giving up. Oh, sir, I will not be giving up. I may stop for a moment, or I may stop for the stream, but I will not be giving up, Bennett Foddy. Okay. Oh, that was so close. That was so close. And the world laughs with you. Weep, and you weep alone. For the sad old earth must borrow its mirth, but has trouble enough of its own. Ella Weaver Wilcox. <laughs> Barry Unleashed. Ooh, Barry, you good fan. Yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm, I'm Gucci. I'm... Better by far that you should forget... Oh my gosh, Bennett. Remember and be sad. Bennett. Christina Rossetti. Nope. Something filled up my heart with nothing. Someone told me not to cry. Ah, bye. Now that I'm older, my heart's So we found Barry's nemesis. <laughs> oh, the arcade fart. Good band. Good band. <laughs> if someone draw some fan art of me against Benefati, that'd be hilarious. Everyone hates Bennett, even though he's a really nice guy. Oh, I have no doubt he's a really nice person. Absolutely no doubt at all. But here's the thing. He put himself in this position. He made himself the agitator. Whether that is to prove an actual point, I don't know. But he knows what he created. And he knows what he was doing when he added all these lines of text. Okay, okay, okay. Gotta go with a large swing. Large swing. Ah, so close. So close. Nope. Nope. Tormented shore, and I hold within my hand grains of the golden sand. How few, yet how they creep through my fingers to the deep while I weep, while I weep. Oh God, can I not grasp them with a tighter clasp? Can I not save one from the pitiless wave? Well, I heard my name, I was doing something. Uh, I, Sprout, uh, I was asking, are you streaming later? Edgar Allan. I'm assuming not. Okay. Oh, no. Okay. Oh, hey, Rory. Mm. Ah, shit. Cat content? Uh, Moss, can we get some cat content? Uh, of course we can. Um, let me go. Hey, Rory. Hey, buddy. How's it going? I require a cat. Yeah, let me, let me zoom in. There he is. There he is. Hey, buddy. Come here, buddy. 
He's not pleased. <laughs> hey. Hey, buddy. Hello. Oh, there's a hairy arm. Look at his little tie. Oh, I love... Yeah, we love his little tie. This is what he does when he wants food. He will sit... He will just sit a slight distance away from me and just not acknowledge me. Or he will get on my desk and... No, no. He's a very calm cat. Yeah, he's a, he's a, he's a calm boy. He just gets very uh, insistent when he wants food. Right. Hope you enjoyed that cat content, everyone. Uh, that by the way, that's the picture of Rory. That's a that's a that's a drawing of Rory. Whenever you hit the meow channel point. Uh, let me go back here. There we go. All right, uh, Barry, you good? Yeah, I'm good. Oh my gosh. See, Can I see another's woe and not be in sorrow too? Can I see another's grief and not seek for kind relief? William Blake. See, this... Who doesn't get insistent when it comes to it? I mean, that's true. That's true. Except I don't go around knocking shit off people's desks. Also, because I'm an Meow. Meow indeed. Shit. See, here's the thing. There's little risk attempting this jump, but also, it's a lot harder. Shit. In the end, we only regret the chances we Shit. didn't take. Lewis Carroll. Alright, 11 more minutes. Shit. There's no real risk for this jump. Yeah, there's no risk for this jump, but it, it's really hard. If you don't know shit off someone's- if you don't knock shit off someone's desk at least once, are you really living? True, 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 true. Damn it. I apparently can't type. That's fine. watch i'm gonna get it right can you check if you have trackpad turning on makes it so the hammer is locked on a certain speed all right i will check uh use trackpad shooting no oh that was close that was so close so close all right got it got my got my uh focus eyes on now Absolute focus. You were recommended on. Oh, alright, alright. Oh, shut us up. Lose the good we oft might win by fearing to attempt. Mm. William Shakespeare, measure for measure. Oh, wow. Okay, alright. Oh, Jesus. Oh. 
They're both, Missy. God, oh my gosh, it's so <laughs> spasmy like this. I only have five eyes, and I gotta use they, they, they gotta be used for multiple purposes. Ah, so close. There are no regrets. Ah, life. shit. Just lessons. Jennifer Aniston. Jennifer Aniston. <laughs> Lol. <laughs> You can turn down the senses. It is a little bit fast, so I'll turn it down even more. Ah, fuck. Ah, I really just want to get up there and just do the, do the, go the other way, but it's such a risk. It's such a risk. When it began, Shut up. or if there were a day when it was not, it has no future but itself. Its Shut infinite realms contain its past, enlightened to perceive new periods of pain. Emily Dickinson. I'll show you new periods of pain. Barry, do you like Yu Gi Oh? I do. I played a couple of simulations here and there. Expectation fails, and most oft where most it promises, and oft it hits where hope is the <gasps> yes. and despair no. sets. William Shakespeare holds oh, well that is. Shit! Shit! <laughs> Even as the stone of the fruit must break, that its heart may stand in the sun, so must you know pain. And if you keep oh your heart in wonder at the daily miracles that was of your amazing. life, your pain would not seem oh less grievous than your joy. The little gibber. Someone's gotta clip that. That was amazing. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> what a cluster, I know, right? <laughs> I was in shock to I was in shock to happiness immediately back into fear and then disappointment. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I'm getting good. I'm getting good now. I'm figuring it out. I've got the position of the hammer down. Now I'm just getting the, the, the arm movement with the mouse. Shit. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. If you wouldn't mind just chucking a link to the Discord in the chat, that would be lovely. Anyone, if you're not part of the Discord, you want to know when I go, uh, me and Moss go live, when things are happening, uh, feel free to join. Love to have you part of the community. Thank you, Missy. Where are we at? Oh, we got one minute left. Alright, Brendan, we'll go take the risky path now. Okay, here we go. <laughs> that went very good for a second there. We're doing it again. Alright, alright, alright. There we go, we got it. This is the Shit. hour of lead. Remember, <laughs> if out lead, there's a freezing person. Alright, 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 alright. Alright. I think, oh, well, I think right. that's gonna be it. I think that's gonna be it. Alright, okay. <laughs> Thank you everyone for hanging out on the stream. We're definitely gonna come back to Benefati at some point in the future. Because this is fun. I'm actually enjoying this. This is a lot of fun. Um, okay. Uh, let's find someone to raid, shall we? Ooh, yeah, oh, definitely. Oh, holy shit, who did that? Who did that? Did someone raid again? I mean, did someone bits? Bits again? Brandon, did you bits again? That was weird. Uh, okay. Let's find someone to raid! Uh, who are- Hey! Tuppernaught is, is playing Resident Evil 6! We are gonna raid them again! Okay. Uh, okay, so we're gonna raid. Uh, okay, before we do that, before we do that, actually, let's go back to the game. I gotta collect this. And jump into this, jump in, he's into here. Uh, I don't see, I didn't see anyone sending, but yeah, I got the, it, it's really weird. I got the, um, I got the audio for the, the bits, the bits, the bits bit. But uh, apparently that didn't work. Okay, so, um, before we do that, 
I finally got this working. Uh, Moss and I finally got this working. But, um, yeah, we got... <laughs> I finally got credits working <laughs> for the stream. <laughs> oh, apparently it, it's not working. It's from last stream. All right, forget that. It's not working. Unless I refresh it. Can I refresh it? it is hey it's working now subscribers sprout thank you for, for, for thank you for subscribing trashy and wild phoenix brendan with the 24 bits thank you thank you thank you hey it worked hey 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 and again thank you everybody for watching really really appreciate it had a fun time tonight Moss, you want to say goodbye thanks everyone for hanging out it was a lot of fun trashy good to meet you Lucky, uh, glad to have you around. Um, feel free to join the Discord as well. Everyone here is very lovely people. Um, all right, let's get the raid going. Let's get the raid going. Do get a raid, and uh, we have this kind of little joke here on um the channel when we raid people. We are referred to as the Moss Holes. So uh, when you get here, say. The moss holes are here, because it's a fun joke. <laughs> All right, thank you everyone so much for hanging out. I really, really appreciate it. Love you all. Have a great rest of your night, and I'll see you at the next stream. Bye, everyone. Thank you.